Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to Byzantium here in EU4 Cossacks. Still on 1.15.1. And we just pieced out with the Mamluks and Hejaz. Take a little bit more of the coastline, including Rosetta, which is an estuary, and Alexandria, which is the center of trade. Now, these are going to go to the um, burgers, but I don't think I can give them away, right, because they're overseas, right? So we have to link up our lands, and then we can give them to the burgers. Eh. Eventually. We also conquered Mecca, which means we have triggered this modifier here. Where is it? Conquest of Mecca. Shit. Gonna give us an extra missionary and 0.5 prestige every year. It's pretty good. Wow, look at Elodia go. I don't think I've ever noticed them, but yeah, they've been on a roll. Hey, thanks for resubbing Sparkso. Put some love in chat for Mr. and Mrs. Sparkso. There we go. Extra missionary. Good times. Kind of stinks that our troops are trapped down here, but you know what I can do is just build one transport. Uh, with one transport, we can definitely get back and forth. Slowly, but surely. Surely. I guess what we should do is build the Suez Canal, right? Why don't we just get on that? Just build the damn Suez Canal. Then you don't need to build some damn transports. All right, free diplomat. I should be fabricating, and I think we're going to fabricate on Naples. His only ally is Milan, and I do believe we can beat Milan. I'm just going to full annex Naples, just get rid of him. How's our aggressive expansion over here? Uh, 34, there's the rebels. Um, you know what? We barely have any. Uh, it's mainly just against other Italians. So it's just the Pope, Genoa. Yeah, it's just the other Italians. The rest of the world doesn't give a shit. At least not about us eating Naples. Checking all of our uh, favors here. It's looking pretty good everywhere. Dispute of succession. Muscovy has no baby. Really? He's 40 years old. Is it worth spending a Diplo slot on that? Probably not, but can you imagine? It's like, yeah, I'll have a union over Muscovy. He's the right religion, even. All right, group up. What missions are out there? I don't like these people. I don't like these missions. And these rivals I can choose from are garbage. Ugh. I do want to rival Hungary at some point, but now is not the time. Not while he's allied to Brandenburg and Austria. Ugh. Alright, so those rebels are done. Let's get a move on. Transfer over here. Get ready to fight the Turks. How many claims do we need? I mean, if we de if we declare a holy war, we don't really need the claims. All they do is they make it 10% cheaper to take land. That's kind of the nice thing about a holy war, or 10% cheaper to core. That's kind of the nice thing about a holy war, is you don't really need claims. You just say, hey, you're the wrong religion. Holy war. You know? It does cost a tiny bit more on admin points, but I think it makes more sense just to go as soon as we're ready, which will be in five years. All right, so in the meantime... Let's lower our army maintenance. Oh, what about our truce with Naples? When is this over? Oh, it's over next year. All right, I guess we do Naples first then. Naples first. France would probably help us in a war with Naples. Uh, when we're done with this next claim, I'll take a look and see if France would join us in an offensive war. He should, because he borders Milan, but we'll see. We'll see. Defender of the Faith. Maybe. What would be the what would be the problem with that? Well, we'd have to defend Muscovy all the time, which is probably okay. We'd have to defend Riazan, which I really don't want to do, but we I mean there's not that many Orthodox nations, so Defender of the Faith wouldn't really be that tough. 5% extra tech cost is not a big deal. And the bonuses like faster war exhaustion reduction are pretty nice. Hmm. I've repaid my loans. Let's get some let's get some buildings first. Let's get some manpower buildings. <sighs> War exhaustion, yearly prestige. Yeah. 
I'm going to focus on buildings for now. We'll probably get Defender of the Faith at some point, though. All right, so what buildings do we want? I want manpower, baby. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Manpower. Seven fifty. Seven fifty. Six twenty-five. Anything better than six twenty-five? Nope. Oh. Okay. One more. Okay. Cool beans. The cruelty of mercenaries. All right, our truce is up with Naples. So yeah, let's rush everyone over there. I just want to get in there and smash his face as fast as possible. Can I pull it next to you? Yes, I can. He's 95 cost. Perfect. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, nom, nom. Holy shit. Georgia wants independence bad. Tell you what. There you go. I'll sacrifice 20 prestige to make sure you don't try to get independence. I don't think Syria is going to find any friends. Oh, Syria, have you been converting? Oh, he has. Syria has converted one province. No, two. He converted Sidi Saida as well. Well, congratulations, Syria, on being somewhat useful. I'm like, hey, if I force convert him, he'll hate me. Yeah, but he'll convert his land for us. He's done two provinces. God damn it, Syria. Like, at this point, he probably would have been... If we had just not forced his hand, he probably would have been a much more useful vassal for helping in wars with his army and his generals and whatever else he has, instead of just being disloyal and hating me and not really converting much. Autonomy and Theodosia. Where's Theodosia? Is that here? No. Thessaly. Where the fuck is Theodosia? No. Theodosia. Uh, not familiar with these terms. Theodosia. There it is. Oh, Kaffa. Kaffa is called Theodosia. Okay. So we could fight 12 rebel... I don't know. Get autonomy and Kaffa. You know what? It's at 82 autonomy. Just fucking... Just max that shit out. I don't care. 82 versus 100? It doesn't matter. If it was 10 autonomy, then 25 would be disastrous. But, eh. 82 autonomy. Whatever. How many troops do you have, Milan? Or not Milan. Uh, but yeah, Milan as well. How many troops do you have, Naples? Sort by name, please. Naples. 11. What about Milan? 28. Okay, Milan is beefy. See, I probably would want France's help in that war. I've helped France in, what, three wars now? So he should probably want to help me by now. Probably. Maybe. We could even be conservative and just take half of his land, but if we take half, he's probably just going to coalition us. I think it makes more sense just to take all four. Just get rid of him. Wipe him off the map. What age is our ruler? Um, 53. What age is your ruler? Also, Muscovy still has no baby. No baby! Alright, France, would you join me? Oh, you bet your ass he would. Yeah, alright. Uh, if that's the case, then I think we're golden. I don't think I want to uh, go without the claims, though. Well, the claims, how much would it save me? It would save me 137, so I'd save 14 points there, and I'd save 20, I, I, 21, 14, 35. I'd save 35 monarch points by waiting two years to fabricate more claims. Doesn't that feel like a waste? But you also get a little bit less aggressive expansion. Just a tiny bit less. No, it's actually the same. If I use superiority, then it's the same. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just do that. Fuck it. 
Fuck it, let's go. All right, keep fabricating on the Turks. What do I want from you guys? Well, I want a lot of stuff. Um, let's get Konya. Actually, let's get Isel. I'm sick of him having a fort. <laughs> He's not allowed to have fort. He's got a fort down here. Not allowed to have forts. Don't be silly. Liturgical reform. Gain legitimacy. I don't need legitimacy. Otherwise, I would. Sweden will remain subject to Denmark. Aw, Sweden. He keeps trying to get independent, and he just keeps failing. Denmark's like, nope, nope, nope. It's been a hundred years and Sweden's still not independent. Can you believe that? A hundred years and Sweden's still not independent. Claim Cyprus? No! Oh, ball. I mean, you know, he's not the best guy. He's a 331, but, oh, man. I mean, he's a strong claim. And I was, oh, balls. <sighs> Two three two Leon with a strong claim. All right, I guess that's just as well. It's the exact same number of pips. Three three one versus two three two. I'd rather have the three three one. But okay. Hey, Francie Pants, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, here comes Naples. Here comes Milan. Uh, we might have to run away. Well, maybe, can we run away? I guess we can sit in the mountains. That's something we could do. We cannot sit in the mountains. Well, fuck me. I thought we were just going to go sit in Abruzzi and be like, hey, hey, you won't attack me in the mountains, will you? Uh, but he's coming down right now. Well, balls. Yeah, I guess I might as well claim Cyprus. Cyprus. Yeah, might have been a little hasty with that declaration there. I mean, France is coming, but he's not even invaded Milan yet. He's not even arrived yet. Right, here we go. He has 4.2 morale. He must have defensive ideas. Oof. We're rolling zeros. I and mean, he rolls zeros too. Okay, we got it. That was a tough battle though. Let's go back and lick our wounds. Oof. I guess we could tech up. Get the tactics, get new... Gen new. Uh, let's tech up in January. It's a little early, but I think it's worth it. Also, did you like how Naples just stood by... Naples could have easily won that battle. Did you like how he just stood by and did dick all? He did nothing. He did nothing. Yeah, I don't want a Regency, that's for sure. We, we may declare preemptively on the Ottomans, like maybe even within this year, uh, just to make sure we don't get a Regency. Or just to make sure we don't get stuck in a Regency. Like not being able to declare war. All right, new units, baby. Offensive or defensive? Um, offensive. Cool. Yeah, Milan's still Tech 11. Perfect. France? France is also Tech 11. Interesting. Okay. Uh, let me keep checking for... Reputation! <gasps> but he's five ducats a month. Fuck. I don't need my navy for this war, do I? No, just keep the navy mothballed. Um, turn off all the forts. All of them.
Might be firing my mercs here. Shit. Shit. Dovis8. Thanks for resubscribing. Put some love in chat for Mr. and or Mrs. Dovis8AS. Yeah, Milan is avoiding the French armies, which I don't blame them. Yeah, Milan's just chilling down here in the Papal, Papal States. France has not finished any sieges yet, though. So France can't even come down here to help me yet. That's okay, though, because I've already teched up. I think we're fine. I mean, just the fact that we teched up a year early makes a big difference. Yeah, neither of them are tech 12 yet, so we're good. We got a wall breach. That's nice. How's Rome doing? Rome is at... Oh, Rome's about to fall. Rome is about to fall. We're sure to get rebels in Mecca. But not yet. You know what? Maybe we can get him out of the war separately. He's at high enthusiasm, but that doesn't mean he'll stay there. His land is falling. And I think he's in like three wars. No, he's just two wars. But still, he's in multiple wars. He should want to peace out with us. Okay, there goes Rome. Which means what? The Pope is at negative 99 war score. Renounce their claims on Siena. Give Milan war reps. Wow, that's a pretty light penalty. Austria has rivaled Poland? No, Poland has rivaled Austria. Okay. I was hoping Poland would rival Hungary, but I guess that'll have to do. I know our power projection is getting low. There's nothing I can do about it. My only rival is is Aragon, and I believe we have a truce for a while. Seven more years of truce with Aragon, so we'll do him eventually. Speaking of that, I need to start fabricating on Aragon. I'm, I have not fabricated on him. I have one claim. Palermo. So I gotta fabricate on Messina. And then I guess once I take Naples, I can fabricate on these two provinces. Yeah. And we might want to go eat the knights. His only ally is Venice. Yeah, we should eat the knights. How much development? 17. Nice. Good province. Got caught fabricating on Cyprus. That's fine. I don't know how the hell Milan is still high enthusiasm. That blows my mind. 80% rebels in Hejaz. Okay. Uh, that might be a problem. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. I mean, we do have a, a transport here. We might be okay. What is this anyway? Five. One. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's fine. We'll just transport them down. Naples is now this is positive siege progress. Good, good. France is going to come down here and kick Milan's butt. That sounds good. Yeah, Milan's at medium. Good. Why is it playing music for China and Japan? What the fuck? All right, what other claims do I want? Konya. Okay. We're getting there. The Ottomans are almost gone. Almost. Also, I need to go eat Ardalan and Botan, but I guess not yet. So much shit to do, man. There's so little time. It's like, how are we supposed to get all this done in 400 years, you know? Oh wow, the Mamluks now have uh, their name across the desert. Look at that shit. That looks nice. I love that. How you get your name across the wasteland. Oh, it's glorious. Good. France is winning another battle. That's great. 
90% progress on Hedges E Rebels. Hopefully they spawn in Mecha where we have Mountain Defense, but they probably won't. They probably won't be that considerate. They haven't spawned yet, but they will. Twenty-eight percent on Naples. Okay, we'll get there. Got this little one transport. He's working so hard. All right, Milan should want peace now. He's getting wrecked. He still doesn't want peace. Why? His capital. His capital's fallen. Another fort has fallen. He's lost every battle in this war, and France is just crushing his face. He does not even want white peace. Like, what the fuck? How does that reasoning make any sense? How would you not want white peace at this point? I don't know. He's stubborn as fuck, I guess. Whew. Still no rebels? Okay. How are we doing here? Mom, Luki, and Separatists? Rosetta and Alexandria. All right. So we'll have to transport some troops down to Rosetta and Alexandria. Hopefully, we'll finish the siege before then. But you know, even if not, I think we can just go. Yeah, we can probably just go. I think we're fine. And then the Ottomans are up next. Okay. Yeah, hopefully this rebellion is not going to be like 30,000 troops. Because if it is, <laughs> I don't know how we're going to deal with it. It better be like, you know, 10 guys or some shit. Well, there goes Naples. Come on down. Don't have a diplomat. I wish I did. We're just barely scraping. We have like no manpower. Disgusting. Ninety percent. Okay. Rosetta Alexandria, you got it. Come on, dock up. Ardalon accepted peace. Full annexation. Hey, Ardalon's dead. All right, Boten. Oh, but he has rebels. <laughs> awesome. So Bolton, Bolton's gonna go. Naples. The garrison should hold for a while. Long enough for me to get peace, I think. Okay, we're ready for rebels to spawn here in. Mamluki and Clay, but they didn't spawn, did they? Sunni Zealous and Kuthaya. Yeah, France has given Milan a drubbing. Look at this shit. Poor Milan. Wow, still no rebels, huh? Just weird. Weird, weird, weird. Hmm. Is it time for another idea group? What would we even take? Diplomatic would be nice. More relationships. Another diplomat. More reputation. Perhaps influence, though. Yeah, let's do influence so it's cheaper to annex our vassals. That makes more sense. Do I want to do it now? No, because we need points to core. Yeah, we need our admin points to core. Hmm. Lose prestige? No. <laughs> Gain prestige. Much better. 
Man, what a tough choice. Do you want to lose prestige or gain prestige? Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Wow, still no rebels. Hmm. All right, we got 93% claiming uh, Cyprus. There's the rebels. And good, they only spawned in Mecca. Although they did spawn with a bigger army than I expected. Uh, we should be okay here. Yeah, we're defending the mountains. They took a river cross. How did they take a river crossing? How does an army that spawns in a province take a river crossing for passing into that? I don't Doesn't make any sense. He didn't cross a river, whatever. So he has negative four to his dice rolls. He's fucked. He's fucked. I don't know how that works. <laughs> but I can't complain. All right, give me a diplomat. We can peace out. Probably do some separate pieces here and get as much money as possible. Yeah. Oh, wow. Augsburg owns Munich? How did Augsburg get Munich? What? What? I'll take all your cash. Uh, give me war reps. Get rid of your alliances and give give up claims, I guess. No, he won't. All right, fine, whatever. Sweet. Now say goodbye to Naples, everybody. Say goodbye to Naples. Who's going to hate me? Uh, the Pope's going to hate me. Austria's going to hate me. Aragon's gonna hate me. All right, well, let the hate flow, baby. Let the hate flow. Whew. Oh, he's rich too. I'll take some ducats. Now this will cause a coalition. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. No way around it. Why can't I increase the autonomy in Salerno? What? Why can't I increase the autonomy in Salerno? Hmm. Well, in any case, this is our coalition map mode as it stands. We will get a coalition out of this war. Guaranteed. 68 from Milan. 58 from Austria, 70 from Aragon, 95 from the Pope. There's going to be, there's got to be a coalition from this. So this is where I say, hey, France, let's stay bestest buddies, okay? France is like, sure, let's be best friends. Because France loves us. And I should probably work on Hungary as well. You know what? With these three allies, maybe there won't even be a coalition. It's possible. Anyway, that's going to have to do it for now. Thanks for watching, everyone. I've been Shen. You've been you. Come back next time for another war with the Ottoman Turks. I'll see you then. Have a good day.